Okay, we're into the 10th week of this uh, COVID-19 uh, pandemic. A um, few options that are uh, easing, in, easing off, but uh, yeah, I'm not uh, in agreement with uh, a few of those, but anyway, enough said on that. So we've got a bit more time. So we're gonna, uh, today, not a massive job really, but one that's needed doing long enough is uh, to address this shed roof. I've had this shed some time now. Um, last week, I gave it a coat of waste oil, which my uh, cousin gave me that tip. Um, it's a way of getting rid of some something that he was gonna throw away, and uh, it's done it quite good. Probably needs another coat, actually, but uh, what coat I have got on, it's done it uh, a world of good. So now what lets it down is the roof. So we're just gonna uh, show you what state the roof is in. As you can see, felt's been stripped, it's gone brittle, blown off. The wood underneath is about added, tongue and groove. So uh, I'm going to treat it to, to a new one. A little repair there, the looks a lot in the past. But, so yeah, I'm going to do it a world of good. Get some fresh strips each end. Here yeah, look, much of uh, come away. Okay, what we're going to be using is this stuff. I know it as sterling board, but uh, I've been told by my uh, lad it is called OSB, which stands for Oriented Strand Board. Quite reasonable, really. Uh, basically, two sheets and a roll of felt come to just short of uh, 60 quid which uh, to do a good repair on the shed which is going to last years uh, it's not a bad price to pay I don't think so we're, uh, we'll get it marked up, cut up and uh, felt nails I'm hoping these are going to be alright oh, I had less, left over from a, another project they're not that long but uh, they'll certainly go through the felt and into the uh, sterling board so uh, let's uh, let's get cracking and make a start. Okay, we've had a uh, go up on the roof and uh, took off the old felt, and we're left with uh, this well past its sell by date tongue and groove. Now luckily. There was a galvanised pressed strip that uh, was sat on the apex there, which is going to hold it together nicely. When uh, we get the two boards cut, climb back down. Oh, yeah. That bit there, look. So once we get the new boards on, that'll go back on top and uh, screw down well with that. So I didn't realise that was. Uh, underneath the felt so I must have refelted it sometime and uh, I've had that bit uh, pressed to put on top so that's gonna uh, gonna work a treat is that okay we've got uh, all that side stripped off now now we've got that removed we're gonna be uh, we're gonna be screwing back the sterling board onto that framework look goes all the way around and it's quite sound is that better than I thought so we're, uh, we're just going to give it a uh, tight few screws just to hold it it's just it's come away as that let's uh, get it a bit more uh, solid and while we're, while we're up here we're going to give it a uh, be daft once we've got it exposed not to give it a treatment of uh, waste oil and it's gonna uh, it's gonna last before we get that board back on. So we'll uh, we'll get on and do that. Right, we've got uh, all exposed pieces treated. So uh, that's a job well done, is that? And once we get that bit of board on, uh, that'll cover up nice. 
So yeah, that's that side uh, ready to uh, board up. But uh, we we'll go to the other side there and remove those timbers and treat it, make it sound, treat it, and uh, get both the sides ready then to put the board on. So we're looking good. Right. It's all the old roof off and uh, we're all uh, treated, exposed areas, ready for uh, getting the new bits of timber on. Right, we've got our uh, bits of sterling board on. So, uh, time now to get some uh, belt cut. Right, we're all uh, belted up now, looking nice and tidy. Nailed on, nice and tight. Quite impressed with that. Right, in between the rain showers, we are uh, going to get the fascia cut and uh, assembled onto there just to tidy it up a bit and that will finish the uh, shed roof off. So uh, let's give it a go. Right, that finishes it off, tidies it up a bit. So uh, once we've got some waste oil on there, It'll, uh, it'll uh, tidy it up well. Right, we've given the uh, fascia a good coating of uh, waste oil and uh, that's uh, it's going to protect it. So uh, I think that's made a good job of that uh, shed that was about ready for scrapping if that uh, roof wasn't going to be uh, replaced. So yeah. That's a job well done, so thanks for uh, watching.